ultimate heat and yes 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 fucking yes i know it's been a good minute i just been extremely busy if you guys don't already know i do own my own business um so i be out a lot especially since it's a delivery fucking business on top of that too so i'll be on the road a shit ton but put that out the way man if y'all don't already know this dude right here is my top three i fucking love this character if you don't already know ito number one who second and now it's this dude and i cannot wait for his fucking rerun man but with all that shit out the way let's go ahead and get into the character right so you don't already know characters like him you want to try to get to 90 especially because his crit i think his crit rate goes up if i'm, if, if I'm not mistaken so you could build him straight crit damage because as you're leveling him up he gets a lot of crit rate but let's go ahead and get into my artifacts first right now my artifacts for this man is really good i got extremely lucky with getting some pieces for him extremely early on right so here we go i got energy recharge 5.8 crit damage 20.2 and crit rate 8.9 like, I don't, you don't need elemental mastery, so don't fucking worry about that shit. But here go my flower. Got a 10.5 crit rate, crit damage 13.2, attack, energy recharge. By time piece, I got a crit damage 27.2, crit rate 3.1, HP defense, and of course you want attack, okay? He does not benefit off of HP, defense, energy. Don't do none of that. Just straight attack, okay? My goblet. Got a okay amino goblet. I can't complain too much, especially given the fact that it's not easy to get a decent roll of a fucking goblet. But here we are. 17.9 crit damage, 7.4 crit rate, energy recharge. And then, of course, my helmet is crit damage, man. Got 12.1 crit rate, energy recharge, 9.7, and attack. I would have loved two attacks. You know what I mean? Take that fucking HP off. But, hey, you know, you get what you get. So, constellations. I have him constellation one. And it's, it's okay, but of course I plan on, I'm trying to, if I can get C6, hey, that'd be perfect. But C1 isn't, isn't too, too bad. My talents, of course, 10, 10, 10, triple crown, baby. Come on, man. If I just said that this dude, my top three, of course he got to be triple. You, you know he got to, right? Let's get into details. So we're back here. Got 66.2 crit rate, 245.8 crit damage. I didn't even show you what weapon I'm using. So I'm rocking the crit damage weapon, of course. I'm rocking the Witsit. Now, reason why I put a crit damage weapon on him because I plan on getting his weapon. Now, I don't know, God, please help me out in the comments, right? I don't know if I should just roll straight for his um weapon and only roll for his weapon to try to get R5s or you know a, a different refinement rank for his weapons or should I just get one of his weapons and then just go straight for constellations? That I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure that shit out. But I had this on him at first with the crit rate, but then y'all know how I get down. That's just too much fucking crit rate. I don't need no damn 90, 99, 90 damn near 100 percent crit rate. I don't need that. All right, that's too much shit. I need more crit damage. So that is why the Witsit is on him. And plus the Witsit hits harder than this anyway if it triggers the right fucking buff. But with that out of the way, let's go ahead and get into and see how he holds up by. Okay, here we go. So now if you don't already know, right, with the set that I have on him, look at that, 15 rack. You want to charge attack, because that's how you get the most damage out of his shit every time you charge attack. Um, you know, he gets a damage bonus, but easily, easily. Didn't even have to use his skill, just straight normal and charge attack. And like I said to, if you go straight, here and you look at his artifact the set that i have on him of course is the desert pavilion circle or whatever how the fuck you chronicle okay you know and basically it says for the four piece shits when charged attacks hit opponent the equipping characters normal attack speed will be increased by 10 percent while normal charge plunging attack damage will be increased by 40 percent so of course you don't already know this motherfucker will be doing a lot of normal attacks so this is what you really wanted for which is perfect then to give you amino damage bonus. All right, now let's go ahead and get into what I use his E. So let's get to it now. All right, here we go. So let's use his Q9. If you don't already know, using his whatchamacallit, uh, water doesn't give him any damage, only attacks do. And you see that? Come on, bro. <laughs> and look at, 
This is why I like this motherfucker, bro. When I seen him at first, I was like, eh, I ain't gonna get him. But then I was like, bro, this motherfucker is the only character in this fucking game that can do some shit like this. Like, that is fucking dope. He just takes to the skies and busts ass. That's all this motherfucker do. So now, let's get to when I use Pyro. So now I'm gonna actually start implementing more elements and shit so I can show you guys how this motherfucker works, all right? All right, here we go. So check this out. So you see this right here? This means I absorb pyro, meaning I get my damage bonus from it, right? Look at this. Look, 25 racks. Come on, bro. Easily, easily. Now, if you don't already know, he could absorb hydro, pyro, electro. I'm not sure if he could absorb cryo. I could be fucking wrong. But right here under his talents, I should have been showed you, <laughs> you guys this shit. But right, okay, he can't absorb cryo. So right here, you just read these shits, and this is what it do if you absorb them. I think you're going to absorb two, but if you get his constellations, you can get three every time, right? So it says attack, you know, pyro increases the attack by 30%, cryo increases crit rate by 20%, electro, normally charged attacks, generate extra energy, and hydro, you're basically, when you are in your fucking floating mode, which is this, it lasts longer, basically. So that's basically what it does. Now, it's time for me to implement his entire kit, right? With his team and all of that. So of course y'all know I'm about to head over there to the big ass chicken robot fucker. So let's hit that, man. All right, let's see what my boy can do. So the way how I normally start this shit, I go bam, 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 okay. Look at that, nice damage, nice. Each hit doing around what, 40, 50, done. Come on, come on, bro. Didn't even have to alt. Didn't even have the alt, and if you don't already know, if you're going to use his alt with him, his 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 alt is okay. I definitely love to get constellations for him for his alt to do a shit ton of damage. But you want to wait until this bar gets really close to being ran out, then you pop his alt, and that's how you do the max damage with his alt, right? But you see that shit, man. Easily clean that motherfucker up, and I know what y'all probably thinking. You probably got C6 with Farzan. You probably. No, the hell I don't. You know how mad I was? I need two fucking more of this chick. Then I will be able to get that 40% crit fucking damage. And keeping her energized would be a lot easier, bro. You see? So I cannot wait to get this. And then on top of that, I get her alt plus three, two. Like, man, these fuckers. But luckily, hopefully, when he comes back out, Farzan should be with him and I would I should easily be able to get her C6 then but you see what kind of damage this dude do man come on you see why I had this man in my third spot I fucking love this dude bro I just float float around boom boom bust shot bust wind blades you know what I'm saying but guys and then look at my look at my wishes look at my I've been saving I've been fucking I got 220 so I know that's not a huge amount but hey it's what I've been saving and I haven't spent no money either so I definitely plan on trying to get his weapon first and then I'm rolling everything for him and hopefully I am able to get a lot of him hey if I'm able to see six him with only 227 hey I take it. I fucking take it but all right then guys that'll be the end of the video man hope you guys enjoyed um, I definitely be uploading the video with me pulling to whenever of course I know he's gonna be out in the next what two two weeks So I try to figure out some other characters that I can upload until then but all right, you guys be safe ultimate out